moving on. This is day two of MB07 2019, Saturday the 20th of April, aforementioned year. Just gone seven o'clock in the morning. I'm staying there and I'm having coffee and a bacon roll here. Spoons after that. And there's big coals, big coals, big coals, slightly bent pole. Spoons and tank. That's the sort of proximity I like. I'm going back to 2012, the first, ooh, and actually only, British Tech Network bash I went to, which I enjoyed a lot. Thank you, Ewan. And I stopped up on this, um, and I think it was Punk IPA, and there was another one. There wasn't, I think it was Dead Pony Club from my local Morrison's. And I loved this. It was complex, hoppy, and wonderful. I'm not sure if it's been sitting in the fridge a lot here. It's now more malty, more caramelly. It's not what I used to like about it. So it's either they've changed the recipe, I have a feeling they have, or it's just been sitting there for too long, possibly. Um, yeah, you can still get a little bit of the hot complexity, but uh, I think I used to give it A minus. I would just give it B plus now. It's confident, it's well made, but it's not what it used to be. And not what I like, which is a shame. These things happen, by the way, so whatever. Easy, lazy Saturday. Suspended in Sabro. If Dean's watching this, likely Otley, but not likely Otley. 4% alcohol by volume. Murky. Nice, gentle, fruity aroma. A gentle, fruity body with some nice spiciness, and the finish is gently bitter, so it does linger and it's nice. It's another corker from Cyro in a gloss to bully glass and I'm in tank B plus plus bricks for Mr. Man nicely cool in here. Oh that's even more fruity now. Refreshing. Super murky collab time. Dreamland from Hot Kettle Brewing and Lucy Brewing. Uh, Lucy Veron from Bin Hampstead and Hot Brewing are from Triple A, Wiltshire. Mm -hmm. I need to find out the 4.4% um, alcohol by volume. Look at that. Mm. A little bit fruity, a little bit musky. Mm. Quite dry, fruity. Sour sharpness. Mm. Extremely hoppy and nicely bitter at the end. Strongly bitter at the end, actually. Lingers like the wind. B plus plus. This will be the last before I move on to the Asha Brewery itself. This is Camouflage from the Stealth Brewing Co. 4.7% alcohol by volume. A dry hot black ale. Mm. Burnt notes, coffee notes. Mm. Very tingly. Lots of coffee. A little bit sharp. Refreshing. On a day like today, B.
Very lingering and tingling and slightly bitter and burnt. Yep, I'm back. I think they're open. Well, this is vegan friendly. This is West Coast Red, 4.8% alcohol by volume. From the Gloucester Brewery, at the Gloucester, at the Gloucester Brewery. Big malt and hops, unfined and hazy. Yeah, I say hazy. Mm. Never mind. Now I'm mm. um, Sweet, malty, and fruity. Um, so I'll a few more in. B plus in a bit. <laughs> 